amulets, charms, pendants, rings, talismanic jewelry, runes, coins, and sachets are various types of objects that are often associated with spirituality, magic, or personal beliefs. Here's a brief description of each. Amulets. Amulets are small objects, often worn as jewelry or carried on a person, believed to have protective or magical properties. They are typically used to ward off evil, bring good luck, or provide some form of spiritual or supernatural protection. For example, ancient Egyptians wore amulets for protection and as symbols of various deities. The Eye of Horus, an amulet representing healing and protection, I was commonly worn to ward off evil. The Ankh, a cross-like symbol, was believed to bring life and good luck. Charms. Charms are similar to amulets and are also believed to possess magical or protective qualities. They can be in the form of small objects, such as trinkets or symbols, that are carried or worn to bring good luck or ward off negative influences. For example, in Chinese culture, various objects are considered lucky charms. The Chinese knot, a decorative knot made from a single length of cord, is believed to bring good luck and ward off evil spirits. The Fu symbol, meaning good fortune, is often displayed or worn during the Lunar New Year. Pendants. Pendants are decorative objects that are worn as jewelry, typically hanging from a necklace or chain. They can have various shapes, designs, and meanings, and may be worn for personal or symbolic reasons. Celtic culture has a rich tradition of intricate knotwork and symbols. Pendants featuring Celtic knots, such as the Trinity knot or the Celtic cross, are worn for their spiritual and protective qualities. Rings. Rings are circular bands worn on the finger, and they can carry symbolic or sentimental value. In the context of spirituality or magic, rings may be used as talismans, engraved with specific symbols or inscriptions believed to possess certain powers or meanings. In Indian culture, rings known as Navaratna rings are adorned with nine gemstones, each representing a different celestial body. These rings are believed to bring good fortune, protection, and balance to the wearer. Talismanic Jewelry Talismanic jewelry refers to pieces of jewelry that are believed to hold special powers or significance. They are often created with specific symbols, gemstones, or materials associated with particular intentions, such as protection, love, or prosperity. In Middle Eastern cultures, talismanic jewelry is often crafted with specific symbols and inscriptions from Islamic traditions. The hand of Fatima, Hamza, and the evil eye are popular symbols believed to provide protection against evil spirits. Runes are ancient alphabetic symbols used in various Germanic languages in the past. In modern contexts, runes are often associated with divination or magical practices. They can be carved or etched onto objects, such as stones or amulets, and used for casting or interpreting the symbols for spiritual or occult purposes. Norse runes, known as the Elder Futhark, were used by the ancient Germanic people. Each rune had both a phonetic value and a deeper meaning. Runes were often carved onto objects or used in divination practices to gain insight and guidance. Coins, particularly those featuring specific symbols or images, can have symbolic or magical significance. They may be used in rituals, spells, or as offerings in spiritual practices. Coins can also be carried or placed in specific locations to attract wealth or prosperity. In Japan, coins called koban are considered lucky and are often carried or placed in homes and businesses to attract wealth and prosperity. The Japanese characters engraved on the coins can have specific meanings associated with good fortune. Sachets. Sachets are small fabric bags or pouches filled with herbs, flowers, or other materials, typically used for their aromatic properties. In the context of spirituality, sachets can be created with specific herbs or ingredients believed to possess certain powers or intentions, such as protection, love, or purification. 
Native American cultures have their own traditions of creating sachets. For example, the Lakota people use medicine pouches to hold sacred items. These examples provide a glimpse into the diverse range of beliefs and practices surrounding amulets, charms, pendants, rings, talismanic jewelry, runes, coins, and sachets across different cultures. It's important to note that beliefs and practices associated with these objects can vary across different cultures, religions, and spiritual traditions. Their meanings and uses may differ depending on the individual or community that employs them.